So the other day, the city decided that they needed to cut down this massive willow oak tree at uh, the local elementary school. Uh, it had started to rot and one of the major limbs had fallen off of it and they were afraid it was going to fall on some cars. This was a massive tree. It was about six and a half feet in diameter at the base. Uh, it was absolutely huge as you can see there in the pictures. We got this big chunk that was about 35 feet up in the tree. It was about 35 inches in diameter. We scaled it at roughly about 4,800 pounds. Uh, we ended up having to split that in half. There's some more logs in the back back there. Uh, it, we ended up milling probably 16 logs out of this. And they were really, really, really nice. And I wanted to show you guys what these limbs looked like as they came off of the mill. Um, it was a lot of work, but I think it was well worth it. This is the first limb that we cut, and it is spectacular. There's so much color in here. Uh, reds, browns, blacks, there's some minor bark inclusions. There's lots and lots of crotch figure in this specific piece. Is going to make some great book matched uh, pieces. Uh, we're probably going to make a bench for the elementary school, but you can see the texture going through this tree. It is just gorgeous. Over here, we've got four four quarter slabs that are already cut off of it, and we're going to get another two four quarters out of this one. Uh, and I think the customer that's paying for this is going to be really, really happy with what he got. Uh, we got about 2,000 board feet of lumber out of this. This is that big section we ended up cutting in half. Um, right now I'm taking off the, the top of it. Uh, I had to trim it down several times. Uh, these are the slabs that are coming out of it. And as you'll see in these pictures, the, the grain was just absolutely beautiful. You couldn't ask for any better of uh, a grain texture for these. Uh, and you can see when I put the tape on it that they're about 20 inches wide, but they're six and a half feet long. So he's going to make benches or countertops with it. Uh, but yeah <laughs> we ended up with quite a few burls off of this thing i think eight in total but these are some of the pictures from before we cut them off that morning if you like these videos and you want to stay up to date with us make sure to click that subscribe button down below you can also visit us at vikingblooded.com and facebook.com forward slash viking blooded and patreon.com forward slash viking blooded. As always, stay safe and have fun.